right guys, welcome back. So I got up this morning and the first thing I saw was a comment from Mr. Buckeye. I hunted down what he said and yes, it is indeed true. The Taurus TH10 is officially coming to the US. Now, this is so exciting for so many reasons, but the first obviously is that it's a double action, single action, hammer fired 10 millimeter polymer frame, drift adjustable Novak sights, pick rail, everything else. Uh, we do have dimensions on this thing now, official dimensions. So it looks like it's gonna come in initially at a four and a quarter inch barrel. So it's gonna be kind of right between that full size and compact. So that's kind of interesting. It's gonna have a capacity of 15. In, in the information listed online, it looks like it will just be a manual safety. It won't have a decocker, so that's unfortunate. Hopefully they're going to provide an option that you can swap that out if you want to. Trigger weight is listed as 6.7 pound single action and a 12 pound double action. So it's definitely a true DASA uh, on the heavy side, especially for a polymer frame pistol. I think a lot of people would be doing some trigger jobs to that. It's gonna come with finger grooves in the frame. But like I said, this isn't the most exciting part. As you well know, many of us have been asking for a subcompact 10 millimeter for quite some time and it looks like Taurus may have been listening. I don't have independent confirmation of this, but again, Mr. Buckeye said in his comment, quote, compact version will be released later this year with a three and a half inch barrel. So yeah, three and a half inch barrel, 10 millimeter, 13 plus one, and it would have the ability to carry the TH10 mags. So you'd be able to throw a 17 in there if you wanted to. So we'll see, I'm really hoping that comes to fruition, but for now, the TH10 is officially coming. Uh, no word on exactly when it's going to release. They haven't officially announced it yet, it just started showing up in SKUs all over online stores. So that's it for today, another 10 millimeter, a DASA hammer fired 10 millimeter, and potentially a compact, I'd almost call that subcompact, three and a half inch barrel, 13 plus one, 10 millimeter, hopefully coming by the end of this year. Let me know what you think. Which one would you like? Would you like either of them? What do you think about a subcompact 10 millimeter? Drop in the comments below. Check out the description below for links to my Patreon, my Spreadshop, my Amazon storefront. All of this helps support the channel. Appreciate you guys. Looking forward to the comments. It's a good day already. Thanks for joining me on the journey. LW Road, out.